Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I explain to you how to set Chrome as default browser on all clients' computers via group policy. For example, this is the client's computer and it works with Windows 10, and I want to make the default browser the Chrome browser. When you open the settings to see the default applications, click on the applications, and click on default applications. Then scroll down, and you will find Microsoft Edge's default browser. If you want to change default browser to Google Chrome on all domain computers, you can create a GPO to make Chrome default browser, and apply it to all domain computers. To do this, there are several steps you'll need to do. And to make Google Chrome the default browser, using Group Policy. Go to the domain server, and follow the steps that I do. The first step, is to create new folder, and share this folder. And I will name the folder Chrome, and then, I will copy this file and paste it inside this folder, I will leave you the link to download this file, in the description of the video, and this file is in XML format, this file is very important. Then right click on the folder, and select properties. Then, click on sharing tab, and then click on advanced sharing button. Select share this folder, and then click the permission button. Then select full control for everyone, click on apply button and OK. Then click on the security tab, click on edit button, then on the add button. Then add the domain users group, so that this folder can be accessed by users, and give the group permission full control. Add any other group, or user you want, I will add a group called test and this is the organizational unit that I will test the GPO and apply it to. And this is the first step, which is creating and sharing the folder, and I move on to the next step. Open Server Manager Dashboard, then click on the Tools menu, from the top of the page, and from there click on Group Policy Management. After opening Group Policy Management, go to the left sidebar, and expand the foreset and click on Domain you will work on. Then, right-click on Organizational Unit called Test, and from the menu, click on Create a GPO in this domain and link it here. This is to create a GPO, and link it to this Organizational Unit. And in New GPO window, enter an appropriate name for this policy, so that it can be easily accessed later, then click OK button. Then right-click on GPO that was just created, and from menu, click on Edit. This will open Group Policy Management Editor window. Now a very important step must be taken, which is adding Google Chrome ID meters by template files, to the policy group, and I will leave link to download Chrome ID meters by template, in the video description. To add Google template, expand policies folder under computer configuration, then right click on administrative templates folder, and from menu, click on add or remove template. Then click on add button, and add Google template to group policy, and I will leave in the video description a video link that explains this method in detail. After that, open the path that appears in front of you on the screen. After reaching the path, go to other side of the available policies, and search for Set Google Chrome as default browser policy, and double click on it to open. Enable this policy, and click on the apply button, and then the OK button. Then, access the path shown in front of you on the screen. After accessing the path, Go to other side of the available policies, and search for, set the default associations configuration file policy, and double click it to open. Enable this policy, but below, you must enter the path of the shared folder, that we created. The path must be written correctly, without any mistake. Open the folder properties and copy the shared path. Copy the path, and paste it into the policy. Pay attention, the full path must be written, in the name of the file inside it, and also with the XML extension, so I will copy the file name, 
and paste it next to the path, as it appears in front of you on the screen. And finally, click on the apply button, then OK. You can now close all open windows, and we will now go to one of the client's computers to test the GPO. The first thing on the client's computer, make sure that you can access hard folder that we have created, open any window, and write the path of the folder. OK, the shared folder has been accessed successfully, then open the settings, and check the default browser. Microsoft Edge is still the default browser, in this case, restart this computer, aha uh -huh check, so that the new policy is applied to it. And after the restart, open the settings to check the default browser. Already the policy has been applied to this computer, and the default browser has been changed to Google Chrome. You can now apply the GPO to all organizational units that you want. You may think that you can change the default browser in a simple way, but if you have a large number of computers, and you have sites many or far away, applying GPO to domain users will be much easier than changing the browser for each computer separately. I hope the video is useful to you. And thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.